Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. So yesterday, I went over the top three best-selling DSLRs on Amazon, and uh, it was quite interesting. But today, I was looking this morning, just out of curiosity, to see if the rankings had changed, because Amazon does note that they can change hourly. And I was really surprised, because it's totally different. I was expecting maybe a little bit of movement in the positioning, but not an entirely different list. Check it out, let's have a look. Okay, so here is the Amazon best sellers list for today. And as you could see, I'm gonna hit the refresh so we're current. So there we go, there is the refresh, today's date. It's quarter after seven, May 23rd, Monday. And number one in full frame cameras today is the Nikon D750. You could see that the first five positions are all APS-C cameras. The number one position today at spot six on the list for full frame cameras is the Nikon D750. Now yesterday, number one was the 5D Mark III, number two was the EOS 6D from Canon, and number three and four was the D750. So this is really interesting because then we drop down to spot nine, which gives us the second best-selling full-frame camera now, and that's the EOS 6D, which has jumped ahead of the 5D. The 5D is now at spot number three, down here at spot number 11 overall for DSLRs. So it's the third best-selling. So we've got number one, the 750 from Nikon, number two, the Canon 6D, and number three, the Canon EOS 5D Mark III. Those are the best-selling full-frame cameras on Amazon right now. Now, I'm not at all surprised about the D750 here being the best seller. I actually would have thought that this was higher, and I mentioned that in yesterday's video. I'm just kind of floored now that it has jumped to number one position. I'm actually floored that all of the positions have changed just in the course of a day, within 24 hours, essentially. Um, this is at 1996.95. Uh, 358 customer reviews, four and a half out of five stars. One of my favorite cameras. I would probably buy it with this configuration here, the um, with the 24 to 120 lens. And if we look, it may well be in the rankings again with that lens. So if we come down, as we said, number two was in the ninth position here. So this is the second best-selling full-frame DSLR. This is the Canon EOS 6D. This is it right here. Nice camera. Decent price at $1399. It's got four and a half out of five stars, 719 customer reviews. And then the 5D Mark III, which only 24 hours ago was in pole position, is now the third best-selling uh, full-frame DSLR. And this is it here. And this is a great camera, although it's getting a little long in the tooth, a little old. But at $24.99, it's probably still not a bad deal. I think if it was me, you're getting a lot more value out of the D750 uh, at le at you know five hundred dollars less price twenty percent less I would buy the D seven fifty, um, and then let's just see out of curiosity what is our next what's the fourth position here, so we've got a bunch of APS C again, and we don't even have another full frame camera in the top twenty, so to go to fourth position I got to come down into the next section the twenty to twenty uh, twenty to forty. And then again, it's the D750. So in fourth position, we have the D750 with the 24 to 120. So this is very interesting because now the D750, as you see here with the 24 to 120, the D750, when you combine its number one position body only with its number four position of 20, with the 24 to 120 lens, um, it's ranking overall combined higher than it would appear just from being in spot one and four. Now let's just check quick uh, what is spot five. And that is the same as yesterday. It's down here at position number 27. But the fifth best selling DSLR is the Nikon D810, which it doesn't surprise me. It's a good seller, but it's more than most people need. But I'm not surprised it's that high in the rankings. It's probably one of the number one studio cameras for a lot of people right now. But um, very interesting, as I said, Number four position, again, is D750, but the D750 is also the 
number one position. If we go back here, you could see, so we're refreshing again, but we've got the 3300, 3300, T5, T6i, T5. That's number one through five in best sellers and DSLR cameras. So the number one position is at number six here. This is the number one position for full frame DSLRs. And that is the D750 right here, as we can see. And uh, very interesting because yesterday it was the 5D Mark III, which is now third down here because the 6D is at number two, is in second position above the 5D Mark III. So quite a shift in positions here within the course of 24 hours on uh, Amazon. Very interesting. And there's the 5D Mark III at number three. So um, what do you guys think? Are you surprised by these rankings? Um, do you, uh, you know, yesterday I was a little surprised. This is probably more in line with what I would think they should be simply because the D750 is the newest out of all these cameras and probably the best performing, well, not probably, it is the best performing out of all these top three cameras. Um, but then the 60 doesn't surprise me at number two because it's a better price. And a lot of people would take the 60 over the 5D Mark III. So it's a little newer and it's half the price basically. So, you know, a really good deal that way. And then the 5D Mark III in third position doesn't really surprise me because really the 750 probably is almost squeezing it out there when you look at it's also number one and number four. So really interesting specs. What do you guys think? What, what do you think about this huge change in positioning within 24 hours on Amazon? And do you think this positioning, the 750 at spot number one, the 6D at spot number two, and the 5D Mark III at spot number three here for full frame cameras is more reflective of what you would have thought should have been the positions, as I'm saying. I think this is a, is a, is a very good representation of what I would have guessed. Anyways, let me know. Leave some comments below. Let's discuss it. The top three full frame cameras and this huge change about this huge change of positioning within 24 hours on Amazon.com. Thanks, folks. Stay tuned. As always, I'll put the links below. You can check out the full details on all these cameras on Amazon just by clicking. Uh, you can find those in the video description. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe for more great videos uh, here at ArtOfTheImage.com. Thanks.